How's it going, Josh? Uh, oh, uh, fine. Josh, Bob likes you. Good. He wants to know if you'd like to go perm. What? Would you like to go perm for Bob, Josh? It wasn't that I was thrown by the idea of working for the Prince of Darkness. I mean, I'd work for worse. Young litigators on crack, say. Josh, just talk to me till dawn. I'll pay you double. At least Satan would be secure in his own powers, and that's a plus. What about it, Josh? I'm sorry, Marlena. I don't go perm on my first week. <laughs> and then, I don't know if it was because we were both Slavic or something, but it was like she could look right into my soul at that moment and she could see my weak spot, and she went right for it. Josh, you go perm, and the firm will cover your psychotherapy. Oh, you're good. To perm or not to perm, in a life of almosts, of unmailed letters and unkept promises, the one constant was my ability to find the escape hatch whenever permness loomed. And yet, at this crucial moment, something held me back. Hey, Josh. So you're perm now. Yeah, for Bob. Oh. Welcome to the S&M family. How's it feel? Uh, it feels uh, great. Oh, hey, hey, Devon. <laughs> hey, we're celebrating my birthday after work today. You want to come?